Alright, welcome to the next tutorial. This will be on uh, hackable doors and the um, turret. So that's the hackable computer. So let's get started. Make a prop, uh, make an entity and call it ASW door. Apply, name it door one or something. And pick a model. Press apply, rotate it a bit. Alright. Pick a color if you want. And set the auto open to no. That's that. And just snap it into place. Alright. Now I have to make a trigger, so find the trigger tool, texture, and create the door area. So let's create that. Alright. Uh, make it um, press Ctrl T and make it a uh, trigger underscore ASW underscore door underscore area. Press apply, name it something like door one trigger. Press apply and make the use target the door. Uh, press apply and that's it. Now we'll make the hackable. Uh, door panel, so make this into a prop dynamic. Press apply, name it something like door one hack prop. Press apply, search for the work, work model for something like uh, search panel 02. So this is the panel. Press OK apply and rotate it this and set the skin to one so it's locked as you can see and um, Now we'll make the um, hackable door trigger. So make another trigger in front of it. Press Ctrl T and make this an ASW um, trigger button area. Just press apply, name it something like door one hack trigger apply um, the panel prop name will be the uh, dynamic prop and here you can set the uh, number of wires you have to fix for the hack number of columns and the number of rows set locked to yes press apply and disable after use at the boss to yes and on the output we make on button hack completed door 1 enable auto open and another one on button hack completed the door one hack prop we set the skin to 2 press apply and this is the hack door now we'll make the um, the turret so create another entity Do oh, right click properties ASW remote turret 
supply um, name it something like jerk one supply and as you can see it's upside down so we'll have to rotate it so um, press con control M oh. Why doesn't it work? Well, we can change it in the pitch yarn roll. So we'll have to change it on the Y 180 plus pi, and we we'll have to rotate it on the Z 90 degrees, I think. Nope. So this will be the turret and stick it up somewhere like this. I uh, will have to make another dynamic prop. So prop dynamic apply world model panel zero one. I like this one. Apply, rotate, put it on the wall, name it something like turret panel, press apply and now we'll make the, um, the a hackable computer trigger. So I'll make another trigger in front of the panel. Press Control T and make it a trigger underscore ASW underscore computer area. Press apply. Name it something like turret hack trigger apply and here you can make it locked so you can hack up oh, make it locked so you can hack it and the computer prop name will be the dynamic prop so third panel apply the third one name will be the third one you can al also add um, cameras or um, a male neo stalks and stuff like that um, was it download time to zero and that's it we need to add a entity and call it ASW tech marine rec because we need a this will make a requirement so you need one tech person in your team otherwise you cannot start the mission save it and run it and I'll go into Alien Swarm so we are in Alien Swarm right now and let's see what we made so as you can see this is the third and the door this is the hack panel and this is the other hack panel so we'll start with the third Syntec Mega Corporation starting hack halfway through Access right. granted. As you can see, here's the turret, and doing? we can control it. So that's the turret. Now let's open the door. As you can see, it won't open. Starting hack. Cover me. Hack is fifty percent. Access and granted. And it will open, hack and complete. it will close. What did I win? Alright, thanks for watching and see you next time.